P041 torque converter clutch system stuck off. All right, let's deal with that. Okay, escape. I'm going to clear. So what do we got here? Live data and engine live data, transmission. We're gonna go back to the transmission. Escape torque converter. Mm-hmm, so enable see what it do Now TC you know, okay, let's see what happens there. Okay slip speed. All right, go ahead Billy Start it up and get up to the gear to the floor. Now that I cleared the code we're gonna see if it tries to command it on Slip speed is at four, three, five. It's supposed to be close to zero. Keep going, Billy. Six, three, eight is not supposed to be doing that. That's why it's going to slip speed cold. So something is wrong there. See if it shows the gear it's in. The gear is fourth gear. There's no short. And it's commanding it on, but it's slipping at over 130 uh, RPM, so some wrong there. Okay, that's it. Alright, you can turn it off. All right, we're gonna drop the pan on this thing. How many miles on there? Oh, 189,000 miles. Something, something should be wrong with this transmission. 180,000 miles, okay. All right, I'm about to get on this freeway here. Slip speed here, the torque converter is engaged. You see it at negative two right there. Zero. That's how you know that the torque converter clutch is applying. Now, if you saw before when I was testing that transmission, uh, before I took this one out, or I took it out and put it in, it was showing high readings because it wasn't applying. The problem was that the computer was doing its job, but the valve body, uh, the TCC solenoid was stuck because there was a lot of metal in that transmission. So the computer couldn't see it applying. It was not applying, okay? So now this transmission has been fixed, and I'm just showing you what a good TCC applied looks like, okay? TCC 
cc slip speed okay it shows tc duty cycle is 34 okay and it's applying at what negative two so that's close to zero no slip now when i come to a stop that slip speed that's at zero will probably or will be higher Let's see here, we're on the road. Let's see where am I going to get off to get back going up here? You may have to give me a GoPro or something, but then. Let's see. Boy, this thing is running smooth, too. Woo! Second Street, where am I? I'm going 60 miles an hour. I'll get off on this Babbitt Road up here. I just want to show you when I stop. cycle is 95, 50, 28. It's not negative zero. Alright, so the TCC duty cycle is zero now, but when it's 34, it's almost like full apply. That's what it's actually showing. The TCC slip speed is now at 526. I am not moving. And the speedometer is at zero. Okay, so there's no short to ground. Right, so this is what we now the TCC slip speed is what we were seeing when the when it was bad, when the valve body or the solenoid, excuse me, not the solenoid, the valve inside of the valve body was stuck. It would be the same as if you have a bad lining in the converter, or if you have a worn bore, a worn valve. When it's supposed to go down to zero, um, it won't do that. It'll constantly uh, show five, three, or 200. Uh, RPM, something like that. Okay. So now I'm going to take back off. Taking back off here. Now I'm about to hit the freeway again. goes. Slip speed went to zero. I have gotten up to about 50 mile an hour. Okay. All right. So now you know. Um, you would throw that slip speed code if you a TCC code if the TCC is not working properly. All right. Now let me get myself back to the shop. This vehicle is ready to go. 
All right, I'm back at the shop uh, after looking at the uh, TCC slip speed and found that it was okay. But when I was on the freeway, I was um, looking at things. Oh, I got Danny here, so he'll be on YouTube too. <laughs> and I saw that this thing was misfiring. I felt something, so I'm looking at the misfire counters here, and in, I see in cylinder eight it shows there was two misfires in here so I wanted to make sure that it was coming from the engine and wasn't coming from the transmission so he has a misfire in cylinder 8 so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 is 7 and 8 no, 7 is fine but 8 is not so Just want to make sure on this uh, uh -oh, this Tahoe. I think this is Tahoe. Yukon Tahoe. They all look the same anyway. Let me see. Let's see what this is. Z11, that's what it is. I think that's a, U, a Yukon or Tahoe. I don't know. I think it's Tahoe. All right, that's it for this video.